Hey, Goat Days, back with another. Let's go and live the good life, the good life tonight. We're gonna live the good life, all right. Let's go and live the good life, the good life tonight. We're gonna live the good life, all right. Let's go. What's up, guys? We're in the mountain, y'all. So, I'm going to grab the lawnmower right quick, get this grass cut. I'll just do a quick in the video, so it ain't gonna be just a full mowing video. But, that's exactly what I'm gonna start with today. So, let's do it. Part of the lawn is Edeldano. Now, I ran out of gas, so <laughs> I literally ran out of gas. Like, I was bringing the mower back to the garage and it said, boom, 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 boom. so it actually cut the entire yard and then ran out of gas as soon as I got done. Pretty crazy, huh? So, I'm gonna go over here, put some gas in her, get her to the garage, and bust out the push mower and get the front and the side, and we'll be done with cutting grass for at least a week. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what? All right, guys, we're fueled up. Just put this mower up.
guys. Oh, yeah. Beautiful butterflies. All we got left is that side piece over there by the garden. And we be done. So I'm gonna fill this thing up with gas, go knock it out real quick, and grass cutting will be done, y'all. All right, y'all, let's get over here and cut this side piece and be done. What do you say? Let's get it. guys that is the entire yard i gotta go take a break that's a lot of grass to cut okay guys i'm gonna shut the garage up i'm going to look for some washers washers washes so i can uh hang my tv up all right guys i'll get back to you in just a second all right guys i don't know quite where to begin man i gotta try to find my saw i got washers and stuff hang the tv up we'll get that done in a little bit but right now i get to dig through here and find my tools yippee all right i'm gonna dig through here and once i find what i'm looking for i'll get back at you all right all right guys so right now i gotta wait for my uh skill saw battery i did find it i found my skill saw my battery and my charger believe it or not and uh a lot of my other tools actually but so I was telling Sam, all of it eventually is gonna go to the garage or the tools go obviously, but I'm not gonna move none of my stuff out there until I get what's already in there organized. Be an ever bit, even bigger mess. So, so right now, while my skill saw charges, we're taking this apart. And get this out of here, and then I'm going to hang the TV up on the wall where it belongs. Trying to see how far I can get taking this thing apart because it weighs 150,000 pounds. So let's do it. <laughs> They're all over our yard. I'd like to try to figure out something to do with them if... Like, I think there's more than one of these trees because they're all, they're all over, over the yard. All, all along that fence line. I think you're probably right. But what do you do with persimmons? You make pudding. Uh, that's all I know of is persimmon pudding, but... Huh. Yeah, I know that one of y'all know what that is. Let us know. And not only that, if it is persimmons, let us know what we can do with them and how do we do it. Something easy for beginners. All I need you to do is keep the dogs from coming in because I might have to open this door. Nope, back. Damn, dude. Hang on, I gotta set it down. So okay. Step down. Get out. 
scoot it. One, two. Oh. Now what? Drop it. Okay, we at least got it on the porch. So, see if we can get it any further. Put it right there in front of that door. Oh, wow. Well. Man, guys, I'm gonna tell you what. Seriously, that thing was a beast. Look at my arms. We got it though. It's out. Yes. We're making progress now, guys. The bridge might have to wait till tomorrow because my battery is still charging and I have to have my skill saw so that I don't have to be running back and forth. My buzzing buddy hasn't buzzed me today. I need to make him some more nectar. Can you believe they already drank all of that nectar? I filled both of those jars up just two weeks ago. They and hungry, babe. That's the only thing left. They completely wiped that one out. We definitely need to make them some more uh, buzzing juice. All right, guys, I'm gonna hang this TV up. So I'm trying to figure out these measurements. So the thing is, the top of the hook there, which will hang on the stand, it measures 20 inches from that to the top of the TV. And I'm gonna need a couple inches in favor to get it to hook up on there. So I'm thinking 22 inches from this here, 22 inches down will be the stand that should give about an inch of room clearance from this. So the top of the TV should be like right here. In my theory, I don't know this for sure. That's what I'm guessing. So. Yeah, y'all. Man, we are knocking stuff out today. All right, guys, so I have decided it's already five o'clock, so I am going to wait and start the bridge tomorrow. So we'll be able to get up. I'm gonna get this video edited so it's ready tonight, and I can wake up and just ting, and then we can get going, like soon as we get up and get going. And uh, we're gonna get started on the bridge. The skill saw battery will be completely charged, and we'll be setting good. I will let you know if I get into anything else or if I'm just gonna start editing, all right? All right, guys, so there's one more thing I do need to do. I got to figure out like a, some kind of flap or something that I can put on the gate to block the center of the gate where the dogs can't slip through. But man, they can slip through like almost every part. Yes, it doesn't matter as long as the dogs can't slip out and go get run over by a dang car. But the only thing, man, is that's not the only spot. Like, so, I mean, they can easily slip right under there and on this side too. 
guess I just cut a piece of wood that's angled right there. Angle it and then strap it there. And do the same thing over here. Thing is now, I just got to find, I wonder if he's got some kind of wire. Just drill a hole in there and just shh, take that wire. And Oh, look at all that wire right there, bro. It's right. Yeah, I knew I seen a bunch of wire in here. Till the devil hit on my soul. I think that's gonna work. I'll grab my skill saw because the battery is charged. So apparently my cordless saw quit working. It worked just fine whenever we were in Oklahoma. For some reason, it just won't power on. So when we build our bridge tomorrow, we're just going to have to run 100,000 feet of extension cord down there and have my plug-in skill saw, which matter of fact, I need to get right now. Since I don't have a portable one, very aggravating. That portable skill saw was legitimately my favorite tool. It made things so much easier. Be all right. I'll get me another one eventually. I just like the Milwaukee. I had a DeWalt. I traded my DeWalt skill saw to my dad for that one because that one held power a lot longer than the DeWalt. The DeWalt would die too quick. All right, guys. I'm going to set y'all up and try to figure this out. I'll take care of this so we don't have to worry about whether the dogs are going to slip out. <laughs> Now, I'm gonna make little corner flaps. Guys, I'm about to run across an actual interstate. Get all out of mode. This is the Sand Springs Church we went to with Chris before we left. Yeah. It says prayers for your travel safety and smooth settling into your new home. Anytime you are back in our area, please join us in study and song and worship. Prayerfully, all the family of the Sand Springs Church of Christ. How cool is that, guys? This is the last church we went to when we were in Oklahoma. My buddy invited us to church and we went to church up there and they mailed us their... That's cool. Okay, so I got to do this side and then we are done, done, done. blocked off the gate opens well my theory worked now we can put the dogs outside and not have to sit there and stress wondering if they're trying to slide out the gate and get hit by a car you know what i mean curly did one day i was, i just luckily happened to be out here cutting grass and for whatever reason i just had the instinct to look up and i looked up and curly had just popped his body through the center of that gate and was headed to the highway i shut off the mower and Curly! He turned around and ran back. And literally, right after I hollered at him, when he turned around, two cars. <laughs> like he would have got hit Did by a car. Back. All right, guys, here, hold up for a sec. I'm gonna roll up these extensions. What's up? What's up, guys? What's up? Look a Yeah, I've got plenty of them, man. There's so many extensions in here.
written down. What's up, you little stud? Stud's done nothing. Say hi, Melinda. We're praying for you tomorrow. We're thinking of you. It's your love message from Coco, Miss Melinda. All right, guys. Another project fulfilled. All right, guys. I think that's going to be the end of what I'm doing today, other than helping Sammy out in the house for whatever whatever she needs. So, And I got to get to editing here pretty quick. And we need to make some more nectar for our buzzing buddies. All right, guys. I hope you had fun. I do apologize because this video more than likely is gonna was more mowing than anything. What do you do? I spent three quarters of the day having to cut the grass. Like that's all I had to record. So, but don't it look so good? I've done the long angles. So I apologize. I love you guys. I hope you had fun hanging out with me today. Tomorrow we're gonna tackle the bridge. We're gonna get started on the bridge. I'm just gonna run some extension cord down there. Have the skill saw down there. Yeah, we're gonna start building a bridge over the overflow creek. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. Y'all know what to do. Love you guys. Till next time, stay blessed. Peace. Yesterday, there was sun and there was rain. Beauty in the mundane. Oh, and as the light startled our eyes, we let go of disguise.